Hello everyone, welcome back to the quiz and answer discussion session. So today's question is from biochemistry and the question is which of the following pathway involves the production of glucose from pyruvate? A choice glycogenolysis, B choice gluconeogenesis, C choice glycogenesis, D choice glycolysis and E choice TCA cycle. So two terminologies you need to know one is genesis what is genesis and what is lysis so genesis means the synthesis or formation of a compound synthesis or formation of a particular compound is called as genesis whereas lysis is nothing but the breakdown the breakdown of a particular compound to a different compound is called as lysis now let's look into each of this choice so the term here the term lysis is there glycogenolysis the breakdown lysis means breakdown and the breakdown of glycogen so glycogenolysis means breakdown of glycogen now glycogen will be uh, broken down to glucose so this process is called as glycogenolysis now where does this process happens it happens in the cytosol or cytoplasm now mainly the cytoplasm of liver and skeletal muscles are the sites for or the location for glycogenolysis so it, it is the conversion of glycogen to glucose or the breakdown of glycogen to glucose is called as glycogenolysis now coming to the second choice gluconeogenesis gluco means glucose genesis means synthesis so it is nothing but synthesis sorry it is nothing but the synthesis of glucose synthesis of glucose now from where it from a non carbohydrate compound from a non carbohydrate compound if glucose is synthesized from a non carbohydrate compound if glucose is synthesized that process is called as gluconeogenesis you can remember this n n indicates non carbohydrate compound non carbohydrate compound now normally glucose could be synthesized from glycogen however glycogen is a carbohydrate compound whenever you take a carbohydrate food that will also be converted to glucose that food stuff is a, basically a carbohydrate con compound now whenever glucose is synthesized from a non carbohydrate compound that process is called as gluconeogenesis now which are those non carbohydrate compound from which glucose is synthesized one of the main non carbohydrate compound is pyruvate so that means pyruvate will be converted to glucose that process could be called as gluconeogenesis also lactate is a non carbohydrate compound from which glucose will be synthesized so that is also that conversion of the conversion of lactate to glucose is also gluconeogenesis another non carbohydrate compound is propionate that means propionate also could be converted to glucose another non carbohydrate compound is glycerol glycerol could be converted to glucose another non carbohydrate compound from which glucose is synthesized is basically amino acids especially glucogenic amino acid glucogenic amino acids that means all this pyruvate lact or lactate or propionate or glycerol or glucogenic amino acid could be converted to glucose and all these compounds are basically non carbohydrate compound therefore the process is called as gluconeogenesis now where does this process happen yes it is cytoplasm only cytosol and mainly it happens in the cytoplasm of liver and kidney so this question also could be asked so gluconeogenesis happens in the cytoplasm of liver as well as kidney and it is nothing but the synthesis of glucose from a non carbohydrate compound like either pyruvate or lactate or propionate or glycerol or glucogenic amino acids now coming to the third choice yes again glycogenesis genesis means synthesis and glyco means glycogen that means glycogen will be synthesized from a particular compound and what is that compound yes it is nothing but glucose that means the conversion of glucose to glycogen or the synthesis of glycogen from glucose is called as glycogenesis now where does this process happen yes it is cytosol or cytoplasm mainly so the cytoplasm of liver and the skeletal muscles are the location skeletal 
muscles are the location for the syn uh, for the glycogenesis process that is synthesis of glycogen from glucose now coming to the fourth choice that is glycolysis so uh, glycolysis is nothing but lysis means breakdown and it is the breakdown of glucose it is the breakdown of glucose either to pyruvate or lactate so the conversion of glucose to pyruvate or lactate is called as uh, glycolysis and in fact if glucose is converted to pyruvate that is called as aerobic glycolysis aerobic glycolysis whereas if glucose is converted to lactate it is called as anaerobic glycolysis now where does this process happens yes it is in the cytosol cytoplasm of all cells so this question also could come the location or the site of location of glycolysis is cytosol of all cells and it is nothing but the conversion of glucose either to pyruvate or lactate now coming to the last choice that is uh, tca cycle so tca cycle is also called as krebs cycle it is also called as citric acid cycle because citric acid uh, uh, is one of the intermediate in the tca cycle or krebs cycle and the process is the conversion of in tca cycle acetyl coa will be converted to will be oxidized to carbon dioxide and water with the production of energy that is atp so this is called as the conversion of acetyl coa or the oxidation of acetyl coa to carbon dioxide and water with the release of energy is called as a tca cycle and in fact it is the final common oxidative pathway of all the food stuff final common oxidative pathway it is the final common oxidative pathway of carbohydrates lipids and proteins now where does this happen yes it happens in the not in the cytoplasm it happens in the mitochondria where it happens in the mitochondria whereas all other process what we have discussed happens in the cytoplasm cytosol okay now coming back to our question uh, which of the following pathway involves the production of glucose from pyruvate so pyruvate is a non carbohydrate compound so the conversion of a non carbohydrate compound to glucose we have already told it, it is gluconeo genesis so the correct answer would be definitely b choice gluconeogenesis thank you